I can take you anywhere, I could take you home. Hey guys, Kids Games here, otherwise known as Kiss, you prefer to call me, and today we are back playing The Sims 2. Let's play Strange Town. So today we are with the Beaker fans, which is Cersei Beaker, Loki Beaker, and Nervous Subject. We have seen a Mr. Loki. Oh, and the Curious episode, I believe. He was arguing with Vidcunt, I believe. Yeah, he was arguing with Vidcunt. But anyway, let's jump in and give these guys an introduction. So, we'll start off with Loki, because why not? How many pissed off face? So, Loki is a knowledge aspiration. He's an adult. Um, his relationships include well, he's friends with Lazlo Curious, Cersei Beaker, and he also is kind of semi close with his sister Erin. So, he's. Fa oh, I've cheated, but oh well. He, yeah, so his family tree is his parents were. Gundrun Beaker and Bjorn Beaker and his sisters Erin Beaker and he's married to Cersei Beaker and her parents were Fano Salamis and Granny Salamis. He is an inventor so he's level 6 in the science career. He has 4 cooking skill, 5 logic and 7 cleaning. Oh no, six, 5 or 6 cleaning I can't really tell. Um, he has no badges. He is a Capricorn, he's neat, outgoing, active, serious and grouchy, and he's thin. His bio reads, as soon as he perfects his latest infection, Loki is sure to get the recogni recognition he knows he deserves. In the meantime, he keeps himself busy by trying to assemble a nuclear reactor out of common household items. He's interested in money, entertainment, crime, work, toys, sci-fi and animals. His hobby is on oh, fi it's science which is very fitting and his memories are he was potty trained by his dad learned to work from his mom potty trained by his mom he grew up he got into private school Aaron was born he learned to study from his dad he got an a plus record up Aaron grew up and he grew up to a teenager he lost a fight with general buzz he met a bunch of people and grew up into a teenager he won a fight with pascal so he doesn't get on with pascal very well made enemies and then he grew, oh no, and then his parents grew up into elders. And then his very first kiss was Cersei. He made enemies with Vidcond, he started going out with Cersei, and then he grew up into an adult and got a job straight away. And then his father died, he got promotion, him and Cersei got engaged, and then his mother died. They got married, they had woohoo, they kidnapped Nervous, or they adopted Nervous, and Nervous grew up badly. And in the recent video, he won a fight with Vidcond. His turns on are accessories, athletic, and his turn off is great dancer. So we'll also go ahead and give him this. So we'll give him knowledge and work. Moving on to Miss Cersei. Cersei is actually Loki, one of my favourite sims. She's really pretty. Um, but yeah, so we've already looked at her family tree. She is actually better friends with everyone else though, compared to Loki. So she's an intern level 4 in medicine. She has free mechanical, free logic, and five cleaning. She also has a vacation day. She is a Capricorn. She's neat, outgoing, active, and serious and grouchy as well. She's also fit. And her bio is, Cersei knows 238 different ways to make someone scream, and none of them are nice. She enjoys taxidermy and collecting coat hangers. Her interests are politics, money, and entertainment, culture, health, food, paranormal, toys, and sci-fi. Her hobby is also science, again very fitting. And her memories are kind of like, so she learned to talk from her mom, learned to talk from her, what learned to work from her mom, put her in by her dad. Her mom taught her how to study. Oh, okay. So she had her very first. She had her first kiss with Vidkund. They started going out when she was a teenager, and then she split up with Vidkund, and her dad died when she was a teen. Then she kissed Loki, started going out with Loki, and then she grew up, and her mum died when she was an adult. And she got married, she moved out, moved in with Loki, then they got married, then they adopted Nervous, slash kidnapped, and here we are. Her turns on are hard worker, a great cook, and her turn off is unemployed. And we'll also go ahead and give her her points. And last but not least, we have 
the nervous subject look at him looking all like oh god that's not a good look for you hon so he is really good friends with pascal um he is aquarius and he's active his bio is his hobbies include twitching and blinking a lot he's interested in politics money entertainment no he's not interested in entertainment sorry food health paranormal weather sci-fi and travel his hobby is bear with me do, 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 sports <laughs> and his memories are grew up badly grew up badly grew up well moved out and then moved in and willow died so he knows enough he like any so i think he kind of knows who they are i'm not sure he's turned on our red hair charismatic and accessory and we'll also go ahead and give him his anyway that's a uh, Let's hit play to that, shall we? So they're having a little gossip and then he's gonna have a gossip with Okay, this is their house, so this is like the torture chamber and this is Nervous's bedroom. How sweet he's actually he needs to pee. I think she's gonna go to work. Yes, she is. She's off to work already. And Loki also needs to pee. So we'll get him to come upstairs and just bathroom. Their house is like so weird. I just, I don't know, it's because it's like a torture chamber. So he needs a cooking skill point and a cleaning skill point. So we're gonna get him to come over here. I don't know what these do. And I'm always scared to use them. Because I honestly just have no idea what they're meant for. I don't know if they're meant for like stealing skills. I'll have to kind of look it up and I'll have to give them all makeovers too but yeah so we are playing with the beakers I don't really know what to do with the beakers because I always kind of feel like like I just don't know what to do with them I feel like they're a done family I feel like nervous we can focus on trying to like escape and get back home maybe I don't know and Loki I feel like he's just gonna want to kidnap people and torture them which We'll do. Why not? I kind of want to get a cow plant, which I think could be fun. We could like kill people with it and be evil. But he's gonna get hungry, and I feel like because nervous is like this like mad servant, he has to like he has to make breakfast for everyone. I have not played The Sims 2 in some amount of time. Honestly, all I play now is The Sims 4. Like I'm not even joking. But I like literally have no idea what to do with the Beaker family. Like, they're kind of like I have like I'm still lost on what to do with them because I feel like I want to get Cersei with Vidkund. Like, not gonna lie, I feel like she deserves to be with Vidkund. But I feel like she's also trapped under Loki's spell. I feel like I feel like Loki's really abusive. But well, Vidkund actually just came and stole her newspaper. And I feel like Nervous needs to kind of like somewhat escape, and he wants to be with Pascal. So you know, oh, there's people. Coming to our door as just Mr. Humble. Um, yeah, but I feel like Nervous is kind of like their slave, if that makes sense. But I feel like Loki's like a sleaze. Like, I feel like he, I don't know why, I, I didn't mean to do that. But I feel like he's a sleaze. I feel like he would like cheat on Cersei and would kind of like try and trap him. Anyway, he's gonna come over here and use this thing because I feel like Loki's like, I'm testing you, get in here. So I don't have a clue what this does. Oh, I think it's your needs. Oh, all right, okay then. Well, I think he can, why doesn't he go ahead and practice lying? Just get tortured for a little while. <laughs> Loki is making an espresso. His social is kind of low. Do they have... No, okay, I'm gonna go ahead and buy them a computer. And I think he's gonna come on here and chat with... I kind of want him to chat with, like, a girl. Because I want him to, like... Um find someone else that he can like hook up with if that makes sense but for now we'll just get him to study his cleaning so he can get his skills up nervous is over here 
I'm just, yeah, he's just over here doing stuff. I feel like there is a way for them to take his skills. Oh, absorb skill from, okay, yeah. So we're gonna get him to get like all Loki's skills up and then Loki can absorb them. As well as learn at the same time. Cause he's a sleaze like that, you know? He is a sleaze. Oh, the phone is a ringing. Come over here and answer it, please. The UF though, so crash site. Is Cersei available to talk? No. She's not. Do we know her now? Damn it. Is there anyone new we can chat with yet? No. This phone is so busy today. No, Cersei. All these people know who Cersei is. In fact, that's what we are going to go ahead, actually. And we're going to hire a maid service and a garden service because I want him, like I said, to have affairs. I want him to be like the Don Lafario of Strange Town, but like a gimp that no one would sleep with unless, like, you know, they, they were, I don't know. No, I don't want a male one. I want a girl. Girl. I want a girl maid, please. No. Oh, yay! Cersei's been promoted. Go, Cersei. We'll try the maid thing again. Please be a female maid this time. Oh, well, I'm glad. No, okay. We'll try again later. I'm very glad that she... Got, uh, what do you call it? I don't know. What am I saying? That she got a bonus, no promotion. <laughs> oh my god! I honestly did not know where I was going with that. But I think she's gonna come up here and practice. He's done that enough. Why don't you study some cooking skills so that Lucky can steal it off you later? She's going to come and practice some of this, get her skill up a bit, plus it also takes her fun up. Loki on the other hand. Loki social is terrible and he is hungry, so why don't you come over here and chat with... Chat with Kirsten. And Nervous is going to come over here and serve some chicken chow mein. He's going to serve some chicken chow mein for the household and then he's also gonna use the toilet and jump in the shower and Cersei you have studied that enough you can come over and answer the phone please she probably won't eat anything she is not that hungry is nervous available to talk okay sure we'll say yeah so that's his mum um, he's obviously not gonna get to the phone because I feel like Cersei is a lot more nicer than we're led to believe and I feel like Loki's the one that's like, I don't know, I feel like Loki is the one that has kind of corrupted her if that makes sense. She's also gonna go to sleep. Um, but yeah I feel like Loki's the one that's corrupted her and has made her like become this like evil lady if that makes sense. I feel like naturally she's a really nice person and you know being with Loki has just made her evil and I kind of want to change that and that's why I kind of feel like Vidkund would fight to get back with her and I feel like Vidkund would like expose Loki for like the evil guy that he is and I'd you know I think we should do that however I know that Loki does want children and I feel like Cersei doesn't want kids, especially not yet. I feel like she's like, she's so career driven that like, why would she want kids? You know, it's just not in her nature to want them. But everyone is going to be going to sleep. Apart from Nervous, he's going to get the skill point first. And since they're going to go to bed, in fact, Nervous actually, I feel like the only time he gets to talk to people is when they when they are in bed. And in fact, he'll be asleep, so there's no point in even trying to call him. I was gonna say you can call Pascal, but 
but there's no point. But because uh, they're all sleeping, I'm going to go ahead and skip back to the morning and I will give them their updated looks. But it is morning and everyone is awake and getting ready for the day. This is Cersei's new look. I think she looks so cute. I changed all her outfits, by the way. And with Loki, I just changed his pyjamas and his everyday wear and kept his hair th the same. And Nervous, I have decided not to update his look. Only because I feel like he doesn't have the privilege, you know, because he's like trapped in here. So, yeah. Um, but he's also going to be getting up soon and he'll have to clean the house because that is his duties. Um, and then he's going to come and study cooking more for Loki. Loki is working today, he's working at 10am. He is also going to study cooking and at least get one skill so he will get promoted the next time he goes to work. And Cersei, I think when Loki goes to work, is going to invite Vidkant over because he said that he'd like to see her. Um, or she can maybe meet him somewhere, I don't know, probably invite him over. But she's also going to focus on her skills this morning. Um, so we're going to get her to study some cleaning. Because I feel like Loki's nervous when it comes to like getting his skills up. But I feel like Cersei is not, you know, I feel like she's like, I I will do what I need to do. Like, I grew up without my father a little bit because she died when she was younger. So she just had to help her mum out. So I feel like she's not as evil as Loki. She probably maybe, I feel like she might not even fully understand, like, everything that goes on. In fact, I'm also going to quickly put in, like the bookcase door because I feel like you know it's just like they would want this hidden go ahead and delete that um because you know I feel like they wouldn't want this out there if that makes sense um He's gonna go off to work. Nervous is gonna study cooking. And since Vidkund is now off to work, Maths. Cersei here is going to come over. He might be working, to be fair. And she's gonna call Vidkund. And she's gonna invite him over. So he is going to be coming over. So I feel like she's going to be really excited because I feel like she never gets out of the house either unless she's going to work. So I feel like she'll be excited to um to see him. That is one hell of a drop by the way. Can we just talk about that? One hell of a drop. So Vidkin's here. I'm going to go over and greet him. And be like, he stays all the way over there. Like, thank you for coming over. And I feel like Oh my god. That is amazing. He's like, please love me. And she's like, mm mm, honey. No way. Too soon. Oh, he's like, run out of steady before. But you know, they're gonna. They're gonna. They're gonna chat a little bit, you know. Get their friendship up. Nervous. You need some fun in your life and your social's also kind of low. So why don't you come on over while she's distracted with Vidkund and why don't you chat with Pascal? I think he like really likes Pascal. I think he's got a very very big crush on Pascal and I think he wants to invite Pascal over tonight if he can. They two are getting on very good. There's like a little bit of and going on you know not too much um but yeah i feel like they're gonna have this conversation and then she's gonna say goodbye to him he's gonna come over and actually get some leftovers because he is very very hungry and then he can play some sss3 while she's distracted oh wait um 
hang this up first and get leftovers and then play some SSX free. What time will Lucky be home? In seven, okay. So he needs to make sure that the house is tidy and that he isn't doing anything unacceptable or that he's not allowed to do it before Loki gets home. But her and Vidkund made some good progress. She actually has to go to work tonight. Loki is not available. Stock for some reason. In fact, she is going to work tonight. He gets home at 7. So we can try and get Pascal to come over if possible. Uh, no, Cersei is not available. She's literally just left for work. Oh my god. Why is it always like they just want to call all the time? But he is going to like clean the house up a little bit, literally just before Loki gets home. Otherwise, he'll get his ass beat. Loki is home right now and oh yes, okay. He's all oh, crystal vu. Yes. So he has brought home crystal vu. And this is great. So I feel like he's gonna do that. Turns out your boss's cousin, yay! Okay, so he's getting a promotion the next time too. So I feel like he's gonna flirt a lot with her. You are hungry again, my little sweet thing. But anyway, he is from her, and like he can see this, and he's like, "This is unacceptable. You're with Cersei," and he's just gonna keep like proposing to her. He's gonna keep flirting with her. And then I think what they're gonna do is I told you he's a sleaze and I feel like Crystal Vu's a bit of a, you know. And he's actually gonna call Pascal. Because look he's distracted with Crystal Vu. He's gonna call Pascal. Okay, maybe until after ten. Why don't you clean that plate up then? And go for a nap. And you can ask Crystal to join. Kiss, cuddle, kiss, kiss. They might not be able to woohoo. Oh, okay, now you can ring Pascal. I'm kind of all over the place this episode. I'm sorry. It's because I've got an idea for my head and I'm just like rushing through it. Because I don't want to play slow. I want to. Oh, he's going to fact that he can ask. Why don't you ask Pascal over on her like little secret date? You guys just keep kissing. Um. Smooch. Suck face. Caress. Try and get these. Romance up, you know, and then if I got, have I not got a thingy downloaded? If I had ACR, I must not. Can we just make you on level already? Okay. And then they're gonna come and relax. As Pascal on a date. Um, ask Crystal to join. You know she's a single gal. She can. She can flirt and sleep with whoever she wants to. She has that privilege. They're gonna go ahead and woo her, and while they're busy upstairs. This is when nervous because like the systems, like house systems, won't be on because like 
Iggy's busy right now and because she's over the like house security systems it won't be on, you know? You're a sleaze, Loki. A sleaze, and I think they're gonna—he's gonna sneak away to the diner. He needs to say goodbye to her as soon as they wake up. You don't want to stand Pascal up. I'm not standing him up. I'm literally—I'm on my way. I'm running there. Although he wouldn't take a taxi, he'd probably walk. Cause you know, where's he getting the money from to afford a taxi? You feel me? But I think he hopes that Cersei kind of won't come and look in his bed. He's like probably put pillows and stuff so it looks as if he's sleeping there. But I think Cersei will probably be knackered after a shift so she won't even bother to check if Pasca, if Nervous is in his bed. Um, and you know, as he said, because Loki's distracted with Crystal, he won't think that um, he'll like want Nervous' attention. Or anything like that. So he wants to spend some time with Pascal. So he's gonna come over here and he's gonna tell Pascal a dirty joke. He's gonna talk and tell him some gossip like, oh my god. So Loki is currently sleeping with Crystal Boo. They're having an affair. And he's gonna be like, oh, what? What do you mean? And I think they're gonna hold hands, sweet talk, and I feel like Nervous is literally just gonna get. Oh! Why is he. Why is he being like that? Okay. Strange. But I feel like Pascal, Nervous is going to be like, Pascal, listen, you're the only person that's there for me. You understand what I'm going through and I just, I've wanted to do this for a while. And Pascal's, what, what do you mean? And he's like, mwah, 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 mwah. give me kisses. <laughs> Aww. Yay. He's going to be like. I love you, I just, I wish I could spend time with you all the time. They're supposed to be on a date right now but it hasn't registered for some reason, which is kind of annoying but, you know, it's okay. And you know, they may as well order some food, in fact wait, come here. That's great, I can't go For some reason they will not hold hands or anything like that. But they may as well grab some food. Pascal's been like, oh, I'll buy you something to eat. Just so you don't starve, you know, I want to make sure you're eating. And Pascal, and Nervous like, I have, I've got a plan to get out of there soon, I promise. It's just gonna take some time. And you know, Pascal's like, as, as long as you get out of it, that's all I care about. Where is... I haven't got one of their things down. Can I call a taxi to leave? Is there not one of the... one of the payphones? Have I not put one of the payphones down? I'm just gonna have to give him a cell phone then, which is completely the opposite of what I would give to him, but you know. Has, has to be done. Um, but he's gonna head home and we're gonna sneak him back home and hope that no one has noticed and that Loki has got rid of Crystal Wu before, you know, um, Cersei has got back. Well, this is actually, I forgot that it's done this. So basically, um, Nervous is not back yet. Um, he needs to like get her to leave because she's literally just came home 
she needs to pee though, so we're gonna get her to quickly pee and jump in a shower. And he has asked Crystal Lou to leave. She is in the leaving. Oh, they literally, he li she literally just missed Crystal Lou. That's lucky for her. So I think he's good. Obviously, the thing is now though, I feel like Loki. Well, I think he's forgot to put the alarms on. We'll see. We forgot. He's forgot to put the alarms on. So he's literally gonna eat that, and then he's gonna head straight to bed. And she's like, "Cool, didn't didn't want no um conversation out of you anyway, hon." But she's gonna play on the PC for a little bit. Play on the PC for a little bit, and she's also gonna head to bed. And now we're literally waiting on Nervous to sneak back home. He's getting home just now, so he's gonna read a book and head to bed himself. And I am going to go ahead and end this part here. If you guys did enjoy, please make sure to smash that like button and comment down below any ideas that I could do with this family because I literally have no idea apart from what I'm running with now. And I feel like it's all kind of meh. But anyway guys, subscribe if you're new here and hit the notification bell so you never miss when a new episode is out. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye guys. One, two, three, fuck it. My darling, I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you.